The arena's fantastic, you know, we've had such a good week up here. The, the facilities are amazing, the, the court's been perfect. And you know, it's just been, been a great competition and it's, and it's a great new facility that they've got here in Glasgow. Yeah, I think it's, it's a massive incentive for, for the youth to, to get playing play the sport. And you know, it's a, a brilliant showcase for the, the top level competition and, and what people can strive to achieve. So hopefully it'll inspire a younger generation to, to take up netball and, and reach the higher levels. I think I was about nine when I started playing and you know, I, I think that's, that's a great age. Some, some people start younger, but I played a whole variety of sports up until the age of about 16, 17, and, and then just kind of focused on netball. So, you know, I think, I think the more sports that kids give a go at, the, the more likely they are to find the one that really suits them. You know, we've, we've been away for five days now and we, we've had a great time as a team. We've had a great time meeting the other teams and, and socialising with them. So there, there's definitely an element of, of fun about it as well. I'd, I'd say give it a go, you know. It, like I say, if you, don't, if you don't give a go, you'll never know. So have a go, see what you like, see what you like, see, see the friends that you make and I'm sure you'll love it. I think it's been fantastic. To be honest, I didn't know much about it until I came here, but the venue is amazing. I thought the core, every, every, uh, all the people have looked after us really well. I think it's going to be a great showcase for the World Juice. I think netball is such an exciting sport. It's, it's an offer in every school, so girls are playing it all over the country. I think one of the biggest things in England is that you don't get to see top-class netball all the time. Um, the World Juice will give a real experience to those players that have never seen the top-level game and somebody to aspire to. You know, They're going to be watching kids that are sort of 16, 17, 18, going up to 21 that are absolutely fantastic and stars of the future. So, you know, we all started, if you hear any of the stories that any of us that went on to play internationally, we all started at school, we all joined our local club um, and it just went on from there and you know, you can't get past the whole training and, and where you pick, pick to go and play for clubs and stuff like that, but there's so many opportunities out there now, um, all the Super League franchise are in offering things, so it's, it's great for, for players to get out there and start playing if they enjoy it, continue to play and you never know where it'll take you. It's an amazing showcase, I think everybody saw what the Olympics did in London and, and this will be no different, you know, in terms of getting people into the building and actually seeing that netball, uh, uh, respecting the sport, you know, people that have never seen it before because at, at top level it's such an amazing sport to watch and I think people are often surprised by that. So I think for the young players to come and see athletes that are a bit older than them that are actually performing, that have trained hard and are reaching the top of their goal, it would be an amazing opportunity. So, you know, some of the best players in the world now are 40 but they've, they've come through the ranks from sort of 16, 17, 18 and, and there's lots of players that are making it. I first got into the national squad at 22 and, and you know, built up from there and some players are getting picked up at 16. So depending on your ability and where you're at and your experiences, there's so many opportunities for you. But it's just a case of, of playing and, and getting into that system and seeing if you enjoy it.